тоже лав. Любулейла. alien has always invoked like this sense of curiosity and wonder. I think for a lot of people it invokes a sense of fear, but I also think that's just because people fear the unknown in general. I feel like, I don't know, it wasn't until college that I was able to like find myself. Like, I don't know, everyone goes through a phase where they like want to be white, I guess. Personally, I've always been very aware of my accent. So when I go to a place like anywhere like in the US and like somebody tells me that I don't really have an accent or like, oh, like your English is so good. Um, it makes me feel like strangely like in place and out of place at the same time. When I stay in the U.S. for a little too long, say it's like four months or so, then when I came back to Thailand, then Thailand becomes an alien place for me. And I need the time to adjust. And then after I came back from, in Thailand for like four or five months, then the U.S. begins to be an alien place for me. And then it just goes back and forth all the time. I think anyone exactly told me that like what I felt was exactly like valid or there were things that like I need to worry about more. In New York I feel alien like especially during the AAPI hate month um there was a lot of hate or sorry AAPI thing um there's a lot of hate crimes in New York and I felt very scared to go outside. One of my close friends, she was like called a bitch and spit on and i have been told to go back home before. Um, a lot of things that I guess make me feel like I'm out of place. I don't know, yeah, those are the words I have, I don't know. I've really struggled recently with this question of um, where my home is because if um, we're saying home is where the heart is then um, then I guess half of it is in China and half of it is in America so it's very um, very um, split right now I guess as a child I definitely associated it with you know, physical surroundings. I think I, now I associate it with more with um, people and kind of um, I've begun to call, you know, my close friends and family across the world um, home. I feel like home is just somewhere you feel safe and loved and happy. Memories that make me feel nostalgic. At the same time, like you feel, or not you, <laughs> I guess me, I, I feel um, kind of like an alien, but like at home at the same time. But I do think it's rather um, 
it's perhaps a prevalent feeling these days is that you feel out of place uh, in a location which you call home. Um, I'm not really sure how to describe the feeling. Putting those two words together, it's kind of bittersweet. It's kind of makes me think of building community with other people that are or have been alienated. Um, so it's kind of like that sweet side of like, well, find a community like affinity and things like that. But at the same time, it's still that really like sour word of alien where it's like, although this is, is your like your group and your home, like what's joining you is um, trauma is kind of a harsh word, but Right, just like just being um, an outsider. Alien home, I guess, is something that everyone can feel. It can, it can honestly not, not in different contexts. But for at least for Asian Americans, I think alien home is something that we like essentially like we embody that because you know we <laughs> I figure, we came into this country as the excluded 